Hello and welcome to the pilot episode of Cookie Clicker 100% Achievement Journey. That's right, Cookie Clicker is now on Steam. Just came back from a trip and uh, I was very surprised that the game was there. I had every intention to play it. I'll explain everything in a moment. By the way, I already have 9 of the 500 and something achievements that they added to the game. That's because when I use the Xbox bar, it makes the game crash. So now I have to use Shadow Play, I have to play around with the thing. So I got maybe 10 minute experience on that game. Did you hear that correctly? That's why I never played this game in my life before. How is that possible on this channel? By the way, if you are new to this channel, welcome. And I invite you to check the playlist. I play a bunch of uh, incremental, idle, clicker, whatever you want to call it. But I never played this one. A game like this, such a pioneer of a clicker game. Why did I never play it? That's because I used to be a PS4 player and I was on a website where you compete for trophies. And then I discovered a game called Clickery Rules 1. And I was amazed with the game, completely got addicted to it. And this is how I discovered this genre. Then I built a decent computer, more than this, a pretty good computer two years ago. And then I decided to switch on Steam. And I joined TrueAchievement.com before becoming a YouTuber, kind of by accident. I invite you to explore my channel if you want to know the circumstances on how this channel was created. But anyways, uh, never got around to play this game, but I want to make a top 10 of the best incremental games of all time. And to do this, I need to educate myself. That means playing, of course, the most significant ones, for instance, I created a new playlist called Trying Out, where I play games where I do not intend to make a series out of. And for instance, I played Ensmenter Dimensions on Kong. Congregate. And uh, I liked it, it's pretty good, but uh, it didn't gain any traction in the video. I'm trying to grow this channel. We're approaching 2,000 subscribers. Thank you very much for your support, everybody. So if you would like me to make a series where I learned this game, and I try to uh, get every single of the 500 achievements. I don't know if it's going to be difficult to do or not. I have no idea because I don't know anything about this game. Well, I knew it existed. I knew it's important in the history of this genre of games. But it's not a game I, I know at all. So even though I'm, I'm really convinced most of you have a lot of experience in this game. Please let me know in the comments. Have you... Who played this game before and who didn't? And did you did you play it a lot or just a little bit? Well, I'm pretty sure I'm part of the minority here. By the way, I'm using an auto clicker. It's a Razer Nostromo. It's about 10 years old. Um, and it's 35 clicks per second. I cannot really go higher than this. It's kind of unstable higher than this. So it should do. And uh, it really feels familiar. Um, my experience is Clicker Heroes 1 and maybe, how was it called again? Narok Clicker or something like this? Which is pretty much a clone of Clicker Heroes. And this would be, I guess, the heroes and this would be the mob and these would be the abilities or something like this. So, yeah, it's a type of game I would get very easily addicted to and uh, I would make all sorts of videos about it. So let me know if you're interested. I sure am, and I'm hoping to see uh, interest in the game. If not, no big deal. I'll just put it, I'll, I'll change the title, put it in another playlist called Try It Out, and I'll play it on my own. I still have to play uh, Antimatter Dimension. I'm pretty sure it's gonna make it in the top 10, and I'll play this one on my own as well. Clicker Rose 1, we're gonna also check it out. I've played it before. I may have found my save. I'm not sure, because uh, it was on my old computer, but anyways. Oh, that's because, yeah, I was playing PS4, right? But I also played on Steam. And it's really on Steam that I pushed uh, much further than PS4. Anyways, they stopped updating at something like that on PS4. I don't think there was Transcendence on PS4, if I'm not mistaken, unless they added it later. But it was much more fun to play on the computer. So yeah, I clicked around a bit too uh, when I was trying to make this thing work. It kept 
crashing uh, when I was trying to use the Xbox bar, but uh, when I see this legacy thing, it looks like, uh, if I click on that, Ascension, and uh, I don't know, uh, I need one more trillion cookies for the next level, so I'm not sure what they mean by, by level, so I'm gonna wait. I think this is way ahead of me. <laughs> okay, let's go one step at a time, just play, you know, just play like that. Also, uh, I'm curious to see how offline games work in this game. Uh, I have no clue. If I hit on maybe stats, these are the upgrades unlocked. Of course, I'm not gonna try to teach anything about this game to anybody. Uh, I think noobs at this game are probably very, very rare. But I can show you the things I discovered, I learned, etc., research. Um, milk flavor so i don't know what milk does anyways i'll have to uh of course this first pilot episode is all uncut with me speaking etc but like in any other series you will see a little bit of editing nothing's too spectacular but some editing and jump cuts and this and that and i'll tell you the progress i made like any series I've ever played before, so if you're new to the channel, check out the other series and you'll see the format. I don't see this game being very different in terms of format than, say, maybe Clicker Rose 2, which is not, <laughs> which could have been an amazing game, but it's, a, it's it's just a fail. But I'm still making a series about it. In fact, a new episode might be coming sooner than I expected. Star System 100 for Sid is coming. So, oh, here's another one. So I think I must have probably 10 Steam achievements. Unfortunately, you missed the few first, but every time I, I click somewhere, I got an achievement. You know how it is when there's so many achievements in a game. You know those games with 5,000 achievements? I think it's the maximum you can get on Steam. These are considered on trueachievement.com like uh, spam games. So that would be it. Um, again, if you're interested, let me know uh, in the views, likes, comments, subscriptions. And if I see this game gaining some traction, we're trying to make this channel make some progress. Well, I will make videos about this game. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please hit thumbs up and leave a comment below. If you want to support this channel, you can subscribe and hit the description bell to make sure you don't miss future videos. Thank you for watching and see you next time.